to last day of spring. This is, I guess, kind of like a part two to uh, one night hot spring. So if you haven't seen that yet, go watch that first and then come back and then we'll play this one. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. I guess that's all I have to say. <laughs> Monday, April 1st. Today the new era name was announced. Rewa comes from the Manyoshu and is meant to represent a is the first time that the era name has been sourced from classical Japanese literature instead of news 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 news. <laughs> okay. Okay, I turn on the option so it Captions the sound. I hope that works for everybody because I'm going to leave it. <laughs> Ugh, everyone's just talking about the new era name. Who even cares? Not like anything's going to change. The emperor doesn't even do anything now. What's the new emperor going to do? Ugh. I wonder what Haru is up to. <laughs> ah, that's cute. Yo, do you see the news? There has to be something better on TV. Hmm. Guess not. Oh, that beep is so freaking cute. I remember it from the first game. So stinking cute. Oh, that's probably how to. Ah, oh, it's so cute. What news? The new era name. Oh, that. I saw. Stupid, right? Sounds like the name of an anime character. Like we should just get rid of it entirely. So annoying. I don't know. I think it sounds pretty. Ah, Haru is such a cutie. Ugh, of course Haru would like it. I bet Manami likes it too. Such goody two shoes. Hey, have you met up with Manami lately? Not since we had that picnic at Shinjuku Gyo and why? No reason, just asking. Picnic, huh? I haven't really talked to Monami since then. Ugh. Why am I even watching this news? This is so boring. Wanna hang out later today? Oh was it Gomen? Ah oh, there Oh, she's sorry. Dinner with coworkers today since it's my first day. Alright. I hope that's going well. Ah! Oh, there's all the emojis. They're so stinking cute. Right? How is a working adult now? It's weird how we're almost the same age, but I'm just a student and she's like a full-fledged member of society. Let me know more about your work later. You didn't tell me anything about it. It's not that interesting. Just tell me anyway. I want to know. Okay, after I get home then. I need to get back though since lunch week is over. Bye! Hmm, what should I do today then? Guess I could ask Manami if she's free. Nah, she's probably hanging out with her boyfriend anyway. But I don't really have anyone else I want to ask. Ugh, I guess I should just call her. Hi, Erika. Hey, Manami. You free today? Actually, I was just about to call you and ask you the same thing. Is this game about Haru? Did I totally lie? I just assumed it was. Because on the uh, website it says to play One Night Hot Spring first. So I just assumed that this also had to deal with Haru. Haru. But maybe not. Uh, actually, I was just about to call you and ask the same thing. I already read that. Whatever, moving on. <laughs> oh, cool. Do you, wanna, do you want to go to Alouette? Maybe, if that's what that says. Ugh. Sure, meet you there in 30. Okay, I'll see you soon. Beep. <laughs> so cute. Hmm, I guess she was free after all. I'd better change out of room clothes before heading out. Hmm, maybe Manami isn't here yet. I guess I could order first. Erika, over here. 
Huh? Oh, she's so cute. She got a haircut, didn't she? No, her hair was always that short. No, it wasn't. Is it? I got us a table. Oh, thanks. I'm just going to order first then. Actually, I already ordered us an afternoon tea set. I hope you don't mind. Was her hair always that short? I could have sworn it was longer. I feel like Enika's was short, Haru's was like medium length, and Manami's was very long. But maybe I'm just making things up. Even though literally just before this, I was looking at um, stills of the game making my thumbnail for the other one. Huh. Not if you're paying, haha. <laughs> My boyfriend paid, actually. He left just a bit earlier. He left? Monami, you don't have to tell him to leave. He said he didn't want to get in the way of our girl talk. That's so... Why do you want to meet up today anyway? Oh, right. I wanted to ask you if you're free this weekend. Well, classes don't start until next week, and I'm a boring hermit. So yeah, I'm free. <laughs> Why? She's funny. <laughs> I still really like Erica. I think she's my favorite. But then, but they're all so cute. Mm, maybe I don't have a favorite. Mm. That's great. I want to surprise Haru for her birthday. Sure. When's her birthday? Today. Oh, that's today. You didn't know. I thought she would have told you. You two talk so often lately. Well, she didn't. I guess she just didn't think to tell me. I'm sure she just forgot. Who forgets their birthday? But it is kind of like a hard, like, how do you tell somebody, oh yeah, it's, it's my birthday. Thanks for not wishing me happy birthday. Even though you couldn't have possibly known that today, right now, is my birthday. <coughs> how do you tell somebody it's your birthday without sounding like that? I'm sure she just forgot. She's busy with her new job, after all. Mmm, I guess. I was planning to go out with her for dinner today, but she's going out with her co-workers. You're going to have dinner together? Yep, wanted to give Haru her present on her birthday. I'm planning on just dropping by her house later tonight. You could have, I don't know, invited me or something. Oh, Erika, I'm really, really sorry. I didn't exclude you on purpose. I just thought that Haru might be a bit tired after her first day, so I kept it to the two of us. Think Haru would I think Haru would really like it if you were there this weekend though. Is that okay? Yeah, well of course. Sorry for being weird. I hope I didn't make you feel left out, Erika. I'm fine. Can we just drop this topic? Are you really okay? I'm fine, Monami. Seriously. If you say so then. I'm still thinking about what to do for Haru. Haru's birthday, though. Could you call me if you have any ideas? Yeah, of course. I also wanted to ask you, are you ready for classes? I'm a bit nervous since we're on our third year now. Well, <laughs> I spent way more time at the cafe than I planned. I love Monami, but she can go on for hours. Haru's probably done work, done with work by now. Might as well send her a message. <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> My brain was wandering, and I just realized that there's probably, like, a... Uh... Some sort of LGBT-themed, uh... Game jam for Pride Month. And I got excited. <laughs> That's why I was gasping. Yeah. Gotta pop all of my fingers even though they don't want to. Because I started doing it because I'm a ding dong! <laughs> okay, moving on. How was your first day of being a real working adult? Also, you really didn't bother telling me. Oh, it's so cute! Happy birthday! Maybe that sounds a bit too salty. Totally cool that you didn't tell me. I know you have work and all. I don't think that makes it any better. Ugh, why do I even care? Let's see what's on then. Now let's take a closer look at the calligraphy of... People are still talking about the new era name? Who even cares? 
Isn't there any real news on? This is ridiculous. The new era isn't even going to start until May. Ugh, I'm just going to take a nap. Ugh, that was a good nap. Hmm, no reply from Haru yet. Maybe she went straight to dinner with her coworkers without checking her phone. No, that message is on red. She's just ignoring me. Yeah, she might not have the time to respond, though. Since she's eating dinner with her coworkers and all. Ugh, why am I being so needy? This isn't like me at all. I should just... Ah, oh, cute! Maybe that's Haru. Unsent a message? I didn't know you could unsend a message. But she apparently has done it. What's Haru playing at? Are you at dinner? If you're really busy, you don't have to reply. Message is on red again, but still no reply. She unsent a message again? Haru! <laughs> what are you doing? Go man. A sorry stamp? That's it? Haru's acting weird. Hey, are you okay? Of course! Why wouldn't I be? <laughs> okay, something is definitely up. Do you want to talk? And she's leaving me on red again. Okay, I'm gonna call. You can just ignore her if you want. But I'm gonna call. Calling now. No answer. Maybe she's really just... Oh. Hi. Hey, how was work? It was okay. Ah, uh, that's great. Are you at dinner with your coworkers then? No. Uh-huh. I didn't go. Why not? Sorry. What? She hung up? What is she? Sorry, I just... I can't talk about it on the phone. Sorry. Okay, just calm down. And stop apologizing. What's wrong? God, I hope our coworkers didn't say anything awful. Was it someone at work? No, everyone is really nice. And work is fun too. It's mostly just sitting in front of a computer. Then what's wrong? Maybe I should just go over to her house. No, that would just make it harder for her to talk. It's really stupid. Just tell me. Whoops. What? Work was really great. It's just, it was my first day, and I had to sign all these forms. Ah, uh, so that's it. I can use my own name for regular work stuff, but for the contract and everything... I have to fill it out with my legal name and my legal gender. I don't know. I just thought, since I'm officially an adult today, I just wanted to do my job with my actual name and gender. But I couldn't. Oh, how do? That's how I feel, Hanukkah. <laughs> Everyone's talking about Rewa. Sorry, I feel all spitty. <laughs> a new era with a new start. Game? Oh, okay. I just wish I could have a new start, too. Game? Why do you keep bragging? It's weird. Like I said... It's really stupid. Why well, I sent a lot of messages. Go then. I can't believe I was sulking about Haru's birthday earlier. I'm such an idiot. Haru, I'm gonna call you now. Erika, why are you... Haru, are you free this weekend? I think I'm free, but... Okay, we're going out then. Keep the day open. I will, but... 
good. Okay. And how do... Yes? I don't care what it says on your stupid family register. You're Haru Suzuki and you're an absolutely amazing woman. So just don't forget that, okay? I'm gonna hang up now. Aww. They're so sweet to each other. I can't believe I just said that. I can't believe I just said that. I feel like somebody in a stupid TV drama. Okay, I need to cool my head a bit. That's all. Oh, wait. Monami. I need to stop her before she goes to Haru's place. Haru's probably in no state to see anybody right now. Hi again, Erika. What is it? Don't give Haru the present tonight. Uh-huh. I mean... I was just thinking that we could both surprise Haru with presents on the weekend. Oh, that sounds great. I'll wait until we all meet up then. Do you have any ideas about what to do? Actually, about that. Since you arranged your own birthday trip last time, I thought maybe I could do the planning this time. To surprise both of you. Oh, that's really sweet. Really? That'd be so nice. But it's such short notice and all. It won't be too much trouble for you? It's fine. I want to do it. Okay then, I'll leave it to you, Erika. Just let me know if you want me to prepare anything. Got it. Talk to you later. I love that beep sound. It's so freaking cute. Okay, I just said all that, but... What am I gonna do? Whatever. I'll work it out. I had I was feeling down, so I need to cheer her up. And what a better way to do that than a surprise birthday party. I can start planning the logistics and all tomorrow. For now, it's bedtime. You, you just woke up, girl. You literally just woke up. Tuesday, April 2nd. I wonder if this game will be hard, uh, harder. <laughs> I meant longer. The last one was about 30 minutes. Sorry. Gotta put my feet under me. It's the most comfortable. Until my feet die and then it's not so comfortable. Okay. Okay, I have until the weekend to plan everything. I should probably at least ask Karu if there's anything she wants to do, though. Yo! About this weekend. If you could go anywhere, where would you go? <laughs> or, like, if you could do anything you wanted, what would you want to do? Are you asking about places to go? Anywhere's fine. Ugh, that's not helpful. <laughs> go back. It's so freaking cute. I don't know where people usually go on weekends. I don't go out much. I just want to know where you want to go. Like maybe somewhere you've always wanted to go, but just never got around to. Or something you want to do, but I haven't had the chance to. I don't know. Go ahead. I really don't go out much. This isn't getting anywhere. Maybe I could think up some options and let how to choose from them. What do people usually do on their birthday? With a regular uni student's budget. You don't have to apologize. I'll figure something out. You have work soon, right? Talk to you later. Okay. I'll try to think about this more. Bye. He's so cute. Birthday activities? Huh. Let's see what the internet suggests. Hmm. A page titled, What do women want to do on their birthdays? What do you want to spend, or who do you want to spend it with? More than half choose their boyfriends slash husbands. That doesn't really apply here. What do you want your boyfriend slash husband to give you? Why does this assume every woman has a boyfriend or a husband? Ugh, this site is awful. It does have a list of popular birthday activities though. Got to got go to a day spa, visit a theme park, a hotel buffet, romantic dinner at night. Romantic dinner is out, but the others could work. This probably won't be that expensive either. Monami and I can each ship in half to cover Haru. Let's see what Haru thinks. Spa, theme park, hotel buffet. What do you think? Hmm. I guess I've never gone to a spa before. Want to go then? I don't know. I probably couldn't. Why not? Because the regular Haru reasons. You know. Ah, right. I guess the spa might have some might have the same issue. Oops. Excuse me, I was reading. No, no. Okay. 
I guess a spa might have the same issues that a hot spring does for transgender people. But I mean, the hot springs worked out last time. I'm sure I could figure something out. Don't worry about that. I'll deal with it. Do you want to go to a spa? Ah, oh, it's so cute. That is like the embodiment of how I feel when husband's like, You want this? You want this thing? And I'm just like, I do. I want it so much, but I feel like I shouldn't. I'd like to. Awesome. It's a date then. As in like a date to go to the spa. Because we set the day for the weekend. So it is a date we set. What am I even saying? <laughs> Thanks, Erika. I really appreciate it. Okay, stop being weird, Erika. You have a birthday thing to plan. Let's see what spas there are around here. Hmm, there's actually quite a few. Didn't realize this was such a big thing. Come to think of it, I've never gone to a spa either. They have them sorted out into categories, though. Which category should I look at? Reasonable prices, super relaxing, pamper yourself. Pamper yourself. It'll be a bit expensive, but it's Hattie's birthday. I can afford to splurge a bit. Let's find a spa with some fancier facilities. Well, I didn't know this hotel had a spa too, but I guess maybe all fancy, fancy hotels have their own spas. Who knows? I've never gone to a fancy hotel. The spa is called Le Chateau. Oh wait, that's a soft sh Oh, sorry. Chateau. Oh wait, that's a soft sh Okay, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Why do people have to name their things in foreign languages? Oh, name their fancy things. Uh, right? I just want to like, just, just know how to say things, okay? It's hard not knowing how to say things, all right? I don't even know what it's supposed to mean. Anyway, let's look at the plans. Might as well get the price shock over with. Oof. <laughs> Wait, this is already more than half off? It still costs 18, what, nope, 180, nope, it's 18,000, okay. Sorry, my brain, too many zeros. Still, yes, I agree with you, Erica. Per person, the original price was 38,000 yen before tax. Oh my God, let's take a look at what the plan includes at least. 90 minute oil and aroma treatment with massage for head, neck, back, legs, and feet. Ah, I feel relaxed just thinking about it. Oh, it also comes with tea time afterwards. The tea room is on the 12th floor with a view of, to of Tokyo Sky Tree. Oh, that's super cool. Tea time includes, wow, I can't even read the name of this tea. It includes a cake set from the hotel though, and the photos look delicious. It still costs. 18,000 yen per person though. 18,000 yen plus 9,000 yen for half of Haru's payment would be 27,000 yen before tax. That's practically 30,000 yen. The plan does sound amazing though. Do I want to look at more spas? Hmm. Why would we check? Mm. I am, uh, I want to just go for it, but why would it give you this option? I'm afraid. Let's save just in case something goes horribly wrong. All right, I'm good. I think I've decided. Let's go with Leishita. This is for Haru. I can afford this. Let's get pampered at Leishita. I just need the book to I just need to book the date then. Should probably check with Manami to see what she thinks first though. Let's give her a call. Maybe Manami can't afford it. Hi Erika, did you decide on a place for Hattie's birthday? I did! I was thinking that since it's Hattie's birthday and all, we could splurge a bit and go to a hotel spa. Oh that sounds lovely! It's really expensive though. But how much is it? 18,000 yen per person before tax. Oh, uh, that sounds fairly reasonable for a hotel spa. Expensive for a uni student's budget, I mean. 
Oh, do you want me to pay for you, Erika? I don't mind. What? No, Manui, of course I don't. But you just said it was expensive. Yes, but... Manami, you're not paying, okay? You can pay for half of Haru's share, but I'm paying for my own. Okay. Actually, Erika, what's the name of the spa? Le Chateau. It's in that fancy hotel with a name I can't pronounce. I think I might have a discount. Huh? Why? My parents are probably members at the, at the, at the hotel. Let me go check. Oh, that'd be super cool. Oh, I got the fancy one. You're welcome, Haru. <laughs> wow, count on Manami's parents to be members of a fancy schmancy hotel. Really look, we really live in two different worlds. We should be able to get a discount on all the spa packages. Really? That's awesome. You'll need my membership info to book though. Do you want me to do you want to meet up tomorrow to make a reservation? Yeah, that'd be great. We can meet up at Alouette again. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow then. See you tomorrow. Okay, so I've chosen location at least. I think that's enough work for today. I guess I can take this time to... Excuse me. A message? Wonder who it is. Glenn. What's Haru apologizing for? What's up? Hmm. No reply. <laughs> What's up with her? Is something wrong? How do you stop on sending messages? It's obnoxious. It's nothing. Ignore me. I was just thinking. You don't really need to do anything for my birthday. I'm sure it's a lot of hassle. It's nothing special. Seriously, what's up with her? Does she not want a birthday party or something? Maybe I should call it off. Heck no! Oh, well, both options are not to call it off, so... Um... Which one is which? Uh, I don't know. I, I feel like this one's less mean, but it might lead to... I'm doing this. It's Hazra's birthday. Of course we should do something. It'd be really weird if we didn't. Nothing special. It's your birthday. It's That's totally special. It happens every year, though. Yeah, that's how birthdays work, Haru. You've had 19 already. You should know the drill. I know, but... I just don't usually do much for my birthday. Just dinner with Manami. Maybe Haru just doesn't want to make a big event of it. Since it's always been just her and Manami before. Maybe it would be better to call this off. No! No. Nah, it's still Haru's birthday after all. We should do something a bit more than just dinner. Well, this year you can do something different. I mean, you turned 22, so you're an adult now. That's worth celebrating. It really isn't too much trouble. It's totally fine, Haru. Aw, it's so cute. I love that sticker. It's like the embodiment of Haru. <laughs> okay, then. Anyway, that's enough work for today. I need to catch up on all the series I'm watching before school starts again. <laughs> Wednesday the 3rd. Manami is taking forever. Erika, I got us some water. Ah, thanks. If you say this number when you book, they should give you a discount. Thanks, Manami. This is huge. Have you ever been to this hotel? No, but I think my father often stays at this chain on business trips. Probably would need to for such a big discount. This makes the price almost affordable for me. I'm glad I could help. The spa plan sounds really nice, so I'm excited. Especially for the tea time afterwards. Do you want to book? Sorry, my phone's vibrating. I think someone's calling me. You can get that. Sorry, I'll be right back. 
Ah, uh, it's probably her boyfriend calling again. I swear, he calls her all the time. It's sweet of him, I guess. Sorry, Etika, could you make the booking yourself? I completely forgot that my boyfriend wanted to meet up today. I can cancel if you want me to, though. Nah, it's fine. Go meet up with your boyfriend. I can handle things from here. I like this music. It's so cute. Oh, I could just feel my shoulder bones like... Big stretch. Like... Popping. Uh, I can handle things from here. Call me if you need anything, okay? I guess I should make the booking then. What was the phone number again? Found it. Let's give them a call. Hello, this is Lei Chateau. How may I help you today? Oh, er, I'd like to make a reservation. What plan would you like to make a reservation for? The uh, Sweet Delight Body Treatment and Tea Time Plan. How many people would you be reserving for? Three people. Also, one of us is a transgender woman. That's okay, right? Please wait a moment. Mm, okay. I sincerely apologize for the wait. Unfortunately, our spa is a woman-only spa. We must ensure that all our guests are utmostly relaxed and that requires a woman-only space. Yeah, and my friend is a woman. We do have a separate men's spa for men. Would you like me to share their information with you? Forget it. Well, that was a waste of time. Whatever, there are other options. Let's try calling some other places. Ugh, that really sucks. I sincerely apologize, but... Unfortunately, we cannot. Ugh, I can't believe it! None of these places are okay with all three of us going together. Ugh, why is everyone so awful? What should I do? I told Haru I'd deal with it, but I... I... Beep. 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 So cute! Oh, it's a message from Haru. Is planning going okay? Should I tell her? No, I told her I'd handle it. We'll figure it out. No, it would just make her sad. She doesn't need to hear about this. Everything's going great. It's going to be awesome. Let me know if there are any problems, though. But what can I do, really? Nothing's going great at all. No, I can't give up yet. I'll look at the site again and check out some other places. But I'll do that tomorrow. I think I need a break. Erika, you're you're wasting all the time. <laughs> God, text heavy real quick. Me, 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 me. Nope, too late. I'm back. Okay. Thursday, April 4th. That was actually good timing on husband. If he was ever going to interrupt, I guess this is a good time to interrupt. <laughs> nothing. I probably called every single listing in the Tokyo area, but nothing. If I hear one more person say they only let people using services for their legal gender, ow. Ow. Like, there's anything I can do. It's so annoying, because it's not like anybody would know. It's not like you're naked. Unless that's what they're talking about, like going and sitting in like a communal area naked. Which is weird, in my opinion. I wouldn't be able to do that. Maybe you should just make your own spot, Erika. I told Hunter I'd work things out. Like I could be her hero or something. I'm so naive. I really don't want to disappoint Haru, though. What should I do? Oh, that's Manami. I should tell her that we need to change our plans. I really don't want to. 
I should at least pick up the phone though. Hey, Monami. Hi, Erika. I'm sorry I had to leave early yesterday. Did you make the reservation? How about that? It didn't work out. What didn't work out? The reservation. Why not? How does gender? Maybe they just didn't understand. I could go talk to them in person. Don't, Monami. I called dozens of places today and I got the same answer from everyone. But... I think we probably should plan something else. Well, I'm sure Haru wouldn't mind. Yeah, but that makes it worse. I just wanted to do something special for her birthday. Since she had a rough time at her first day of work and all. She did, then. And I didn't, she didn't talk to me about it. Yeah, she probably didn't want you to want to worry you. She seemed so happy when I suggested we go to the spa. Erika, I'll call you back when I figure something out. <sighs> I really don't want to tell how did this spa thing didn't work out. I don't know why people care so much anyway. Why is it so hard to find a spa that will just let three women go together? Hurry, I'm complaining about this one thing though. When Hari must go through this every single day. She already said that she probably wouldn't be able to go when I first asked. She already knew how everyone would respond. But I really don't want to prove her right. Isn't there any way Haru can enjoy a spa on her birthday? I guess I could look up spa alternatives on my phone. Instead of spa, go to hot springs uh, go to the hot springs to relax. Ash is gonna have the exact same problems. Come to think of it, the staff at the Ryokan Manami booked were really accommodating. I guess that isn't the norm though. The Super Sento is a good cheap alternative to Nope, the Super Sento is out too. Ugh. Isn't there anything at all? I don't know what a Super Sento is. Does, do you, does any of you know? Because I don't. If you couldn't afford a spa, try making your own spa at home. Huh. A spa at home? You could recreate a spa experience in your own home. This actually sounds okay. Buy spa goods and use them whenever you want. At home. <laughs> Why do you keep this app keeps having to... Why do you keep having to say at home? That's so funny. Here are some treatments you can do yourself. Hmm. That's doable. This too. This isn't quite the same as a spa, but this might be might not be too bad. Let's see what Monami thinks. Erika? Manami, let's go to our own spa. Or let's make our own spa. Huh? I mean, we could just do a home spa. Oh, that would work. Instead of girls day out, we could do a girls day in. My kind of flavor. I don't like going out. A girls day in. I like the sound of that. I don't know how to do messages or that kind of stuff, but I have, oh, massages. Sorry, <laughs> but I have face masks at home. I can go shopping for some stuff too. That sounds good. I'll check what stuff I have at home. We need a place to do this though. I guess my place is okay, though it's a bit cramped. Oh, I've never been to your place before. This is so exciting. Okay, I'm gonna go check what I can bring. It burped. <laughs> I should probably also tell Haru about the change in plans. Good thing I didn't tell her I decided on a place, at least, since it didn't work out. How should I tell her, though? Don't tell her the details. She doesn't need to know what happened. I'll just tell her that I decided a home spa would be more fun. Yo! Hey, Haru. I thought about it, and rather than going out to some random place, I thought it would be more fun spa day at my place. What do you think? <laughs> Wait, she's at work. She probably can't reply now. Go in. Sorry for the spam. Get back to me after work. If we're holding Hunter's birthday thing here, I'm gonna have to clean up a bit. Guess now is as good a time as any, uh, as any to get in some spring cleaning. Yeah, your house is a little bit messy, Erika. <laughs> Ugh, this place is filthy. Who is just leaving their dirty clothes on the floor? Alright. 
That'd be me. What do I do this to myself? Ugh, this place looks so organized. I can mess it up again after Haru's birthday thing, though. Ah, oh, that's probably Haru. Ah, oh, so cute. Is it really okay? I don't want you to go through that through that much trouble. You have to prep at home and everything. Maybe instead we should just do something else. Hmm. Well, Haru doesn't seem really excited. I guess a home spa isn't really what she had been expecting, though. Maybe we should just do something else? No. No! We worked hard on this. Haru is going to like it! No, I can do this. Haru's just being Haru and trying not to be a bother. You know, how Haru does. It's really no trouble at all. I've never really done a spa before either. So it'll be fun to do a test run at home. Um, are you sure? Yeah, don't worry. I've got it handled. <laughs> okay, but let me know if you change your mind. I won't. I cleaned my apartment for this. That's a really big deal, just so you know. Thanks. It's been a long time since I've gone to a friend's home. Don't expect much. My whole apartment is like half the size of Monami's room. That's fine. I'm looking forward to it. Oh, mine's so cute. I'll send you my address later. I still need to prep though. Bye. Sometimes I think Haru messages more in stamps than in like actual words. I think this room is acceptable enough to show to other people now, though. What? <laughs> I had a hard time with that. <sighs> Cold water. My love. Okay, I read that. I just need to buy stuff tomorrow and then everything should be good. Good job, me. I think I've earned myself the right to watch another few episodes. <laughs> Friday, April 5th. <sighs> okay. I definitely watched too many episodes. I'm so sleepy. Ugh, what do I need to buy again? Let's check the list I made this morning. Scented candles, herb tea, and cups, since I own like one mug. Also a salt scrub or something fancy like that. I think I should be able to get everything here. Yeah, it has a good variety. So let's start looking around then. So cute! I don't know how many candles we'll need. I guess I'll just buy a set. Hmm, I probably need something to light the candles with too. The only thing I could possibly use at home is my gas stove. That may cause you some issues. Eh, here. Get out of here. That's probably a bad idea. They have a lot of weird teas. I bet most of these taste awful though. This one has pictures of flowers on it. That's very spa-like, I guess. In the basket it goes. These glass cups look cute too, so I'll just grab these. Oh, so there are sugar scrubs and salt scrubs. No idea which is better though. The sugar one is peppermint scented. Nice. The salt one has coconut oil though, which also sounds nice. I guess I'll just buy one of each. Okay, candles, teas, cups, and a salt scrub. That's everything on the list. This is probably gonna make for, for a pretty weak spa day though. Maybe I should get something extra. Monami said she's bringing face masks, so something other than that. What else should I get? Face roller, nail polish, definitely cucumbers. Hmm, I feel like nail polish. I don't really use nail polish myself, but manicures feel very feel like a very spa thing to do. What colors would be good though? Now that I think about it, I don't think I've ever seen how to nail polish on. 
I'll get some more standard colors then. I don't think we need anything else. I should call Monami just to check though. Well, I hope Hada likes wearing nail polish. Hi, Attica. I just put in the order for the cake. The cake? Oh, right. Hada's birthday cake. Thanks. I'll bring it over tomorrow morning and we can set everything up. We should probably think up a schedule. Monami, we're doing a spa day, not a school field trip. But things will go more smoothly if we have a schedule. Fine, if it'll make you happier. What time do you want to come over? Hmm. If Hara is coming over in the afternoon, I should get there in the morning. Since there's only the one bathroom while Hara is using the salt scrub, we can prepare the cake. Oh, uh, like a surprise sort of thing. Nice. Then after we eat the cake, we can give Haru her birthday present. Right, that sounds... Oh, er, I totally forgot to get Haru a present. Oh well, you did all this prep for the spa day. That's like a present already. Yeah, but it'll be weird if you have a present for her and I don't. Should I not give her my present then? No, that's not what I... Ugh, I can't believe I forgot. That schedule is perfect, Monomi, but I'll call you back later. Now I need to think of something for Haru's present. It's not that hard. Just go to another store while you're already out. I'm such an idiot. How could I forget Haru's birthday present? What would Haru want for her birthday, though? I guess I know what Haru would want, but it's not something I can just buy in a store. I mean, I couldn't even get her a day at the spa. Yeah, no. It's not really time for me to mope. Let's think of a birthday present for Haru. There's no point in getting a present that Haru could buy herself, but is there something she can get that I can actually- Oh, is there something she can't get that I can actually get her? Ugh, I don't know. Maybe the internet can help me again. Present for transgender woman. First result, how about a wallet for your cool transgender friend? Second, taking a look at real women, ex women love. What? Third, the problem was saying it's discrimination to keep people with penises out of the woman's bath. Like, only the first result has anything to do with presents, and the next results are just a lot. Two results about what washroom transgender people should be using. One about what pronouns you should use to talk to transgender people. I just wanted some present ideas. Thanks for nothing, internet. I guess I just have to figure something out on my own. Uh, huh, a message from Haru. Go men. I think I might have a cold. I don't want to get you or Manami sick. Maybe we should cancel the spa day. Haru's sick? I hope her new job isn't tiring her out too much. If it's just a cold, it should be okay though. A spa day would probably actually be some good rest. If Haru would rather cancel though, ask how bad her cold is. If Haru's cold isn't too bad, it'd probably be better to get her out anyway. Is your cold really bad? No, I just feel a little sick. The spa day is the perfect thing to make you feel better. A good soak in a bath should do you good too. I'll buy some fruit or something too. Vitamin C should help. Is there anything you like to eat when you're sick? Sweet things, I guess. Okay, I'll buy some sweet snacks. Actually, maybe I could ask Haru what she wants for her birthday. By the way, is there anything you want for your birthday? Oh, you don't have to get me anything. Just answer the question, Haru. I don't know. I don't really want anything. An idea with my real name and gender on it, maybe. Oh, Haru. Haha. <laughs> Goldman. I know that's not what you meant. Sorry. I made things weird, didn't I? Sorry, just ignore me. Bye. An ID, huh? You can't really do anything about that without, I don't know, petitioning the government? And it's not something one little person like me can change, especially not in a day. But you can start a change? I guess I'll just do what I can. Saturday, April 6th. Hutter's birthday party. Excite! Okay, this looks pretty good. Sure, it's no hotel spa, but it'll do. 
I scattered some rose petals in the bathroom, and it looks really cute. I set up the oil diffuser, too. Thanks, Monami. And thank your mom for me, too. It's really nice of her to let us use all this. She said it's all stuff she had lying around. When I told her we were doing a spa day with Haru, she just gave me all this. She said it'd, it'd help create the atmosphere. Why does she have canvas paintings sliding around the house anyway? She collects art. Manumi, this better not be some really expensive art thing. To be honest, then I don't know. Remind me to be really careful when taking that down. <laughs> you really don't have to worry. Oh, my phone's vibrating. It's Haru. Sorry, do you mind if I take this? Nah, go ahead. Hi, Haru. How are... Oh, are you okay? Mm-hmm. Are you sure? I can go over if you... If you're sure, I'll tell her. Don't worry. Did something happen? Haru says she can't make it today. She's not feeling well. Ah, uh, she says that she thought she had a cold yesterday. I guess it got worse. I don't think that's it. Haru does this a lot. Huh? We'll have arranged a meeting up on a day. Then suddenly she'll be sick or she'll have some other thing come up. I think she gets anxious about meeting people sometimes. Dude, same. Like, fully same. The most same. Even you? you know, you've known her forever. Yes, but I think that makes it worse sometimes. But why would... I've known Haru since before. Before what? Oh. She still felt like she had to hide who she was back then. Even with me. So even now, I think... It can be hard for Haru to, completely, to be completely honest with me. I guess that's one reason, yeah. One reason? Uh, just ignore me. Could you talk to Haru for me? Huh? I think she's more honest with you than with me. I'll talk to her. Thank you, Erika. I'm gonna head back then. See you, Manami. See you, Erika. Mm, that's sad. Our planning kind of went to a little bit of waste, but it's mostly sad that Haru doesn't feel comfortable coming. I should message Haru. Hey! What should I even say? Manami thinks you're lying about being sick? Yeah, that'd go over well. Haru, I just want to check, but is there some reason you don't want to do a spa day? Guess all I can do is wait for a reply. Sorry, I just can't. She just can't? Is it okay if I call? Is it okay if I put my feet under me? <sighs> Thumbs up. Cool. Okay then. What did Monami tell you? She just said you weren't feeling well. I forgot I wasn't wearing a ponytail. I was like, oh, where'd my pony go? <laughs> Is that really all? I'm sorry if this wasn't something you wanted. Do you want to do something else for your birthday? What? No, that's not it. I just... It's not your fault, Etika. It's not Monami's fault either. It's just me. It's always me. Haru? Sorry, I just couldn't go. I'm sorry. You two did all this for me and I... I just ruined everything. Haru, calm down. It's fine. It's fine, okay? Haru, I just want to know what's wrong. We can scrap the spa day, okay? But could you come over so we can talk? I'm worried about you. Is Monami there? She left earlier. Okay. I'll come over soon. Hmm. I, 
guess all I can do is wait then. No point in just sitting here though. Maybe I'll eat something. Oh, Hunter's birthday cake is still in the fridge. On second thought, I'm not really that hungry. Sad face. It's probably Haru at the door. The door is open. Oh, Haru's hair is up. I haven't seen that before. She looks super tall. <laughs> Such as me. Hi, Erika. Hey, you don't have to look so down. It's okay. I'm really sorry. Why? You did all this for me and I... Hey, it's okay. If it's too hard to talk, we can just not do that. I bought snacks. You can have sa snacks. I have herb tea too. Thanks, Erika. Hmm? I feel a bit better now. Why? I didn't do anything. I don't know. I wish I weren't like this. Like what? I really was looking forward to the spa day with you two. I was. But for some reason this whole week, my head just kept telling me to find a way out of it. I just knew I was... I just knew it was going to go badly. At first I thought it'd be nice to go to a spa. But then I remembered there was no way I'd be able to go to a spa. Then when you said you changed the plans to a home spa, at first I felt relieved since it wouldn't be so since it would be in a private place. But then I got all anxious about it again, so I told Monami I was sick and couldn't go. How do I'm sorry. And I didn't realize. Is that why you kept messaging this week? Asking me if I wanted to cancel? Yeah. I just wasn't sure I was ready for a spa. But you were okay with the Rokan, right? In the end I was, but at the Rokan, I only went into the bath with you, Erika. I didn't go into the bath in my playthrough. Shit. Even more reason to get the game yourself and go play it. Um. Oh, it's apparently on Steam. I totally... I saw that earlier today. I didn't realize I would have linked um, the Steam info as well. Now I want to go back though and see like, what happens if we go into the spa? Wait, there wasn't an option to go into the spa, was there? We must have done something that took out that option. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> don't know. I guess that was the way to get to the best end though. This time, Manami would, would be here too, and I didn't know what we were going to do for the spa. Sometimes you take baths at spas, right? I just didn't want her to see me. When my body doesn't look the way I feel like I should look. Right, Manami. I know, it's stupid. Manami's known me forever. She knows that I haven't... That I haven't had surgery. But I still... It's Monami, so I just... Haru? That's not stupid at all. Erika. Thank you for telling me, Haru. It means a lot to me. Let's call Monami later and figure out something else to do for your birthday, okay? Okay. Thanks, Erika. No problem. You know, we can't just skip all the bath stuff. Uh-huh. I still have herbal tea and face masks and stuff. You've come all the way here. Wanna try it out? I've never done any of this spa stuff before either. And I'd feel really silly just doing it by myself. Want to have a mini spa day, just the two of us? I'd like that. Aw, oh, cute! I'm sorry if I get any on your skin, okay? I don't really paint nails much. It's okay. I'm sure you'll do a better job than I can. Is this color okay? I don't really know what color would be good. Anything anything you think would be good is fine. Okay, then I'm gonna go with this color. What do you think? It's cute. 
You like it then? I do. I've never painted my nails before. I don't usually do my nails either. It's so much work and they just get chipped. Like, like these. This hand is worse. I crochet with these fingers. The yarn is not nice on my nail polish. <laughs> Uh, yeah, read that. Okay, cool. I probably won't use this again, so if you want, keep this manicure set. Thanks, Erika. I'll try painting my nails myself sometime. Aw, oh, cute! I'm glad we picked the nail polish. Ah, I feel refreshed. Yeah, that was fun. You feeling a bit better now? Yeah, thanks, Erika. Don't worry about it. Sorry it's not as fancy as a real spa, though. I guess the spas you contacted didn't work out then. Uh... We were trying to keep it a secret from her! Now what? Doo -doo. Me and my habit of not saving. Oh wow, we've already been playing this for an hour? Oh, well then I guess heaven did interrupt at that one point. I don't know how long it's actually been. Um, hmm. Ellipses. I'm right then. It's fine. I thought that would happen. How do... I don't blame them. Legally, they could get into trouble if they let me in. But how do you're legally not a woman? But, that's just how it is. I probably wouldn't have been comfortable going to a spa anyway. I mean, the staff wouldn't have been comfortable with my body. I'm not even comfortable with my body. So, it's really a good thing that it didn't work out. How to... This was really fun though, Erika. Thank you for preparing everything. I just wish I could could have done more. I didn't think that there would be any issues making a booking with a spa. I didn't realize that. I just didn't get it. Don't blame yourself, Erika. I'm happy you tried, even if it, even if I did think it wouldn't work. How are you not just angry all the time? I'd be furious with everything if I were you. You get used to it. I know some people who can get angry at every bad thing that happens to them and they fight to make things better. I'm really thankful for everything they do, but it just gets to be so much, and I can't do it, not all the time. How do? I mean, all over the news, people are talking about Rewa, the new era. They're talking about the era changing and what that might change for everyone, but nothing's changing for me. Nothing. I mean, the Supreme Court upheld that law that transgender people need to be sterilized to change their legal gender. That was just this January. Oof. Sure, they said this law might become outdated as society changes, but are they changing the law? No. So I can't change my legal gender. And even if I did, I still wouldn't be able to get married to, to the person I love. So what if a couple of wards have something similar to marriage for gay couples now? They're only valid in those wards. They're not really recognized as marriages. Everywhere I go, I feel like I'm being turned away. I'm gonna cry. I can't go to women's spaces because I'm not legally a woman. But I can't go to men's spaces because I obviously don't belong there either. It just makes me too anxious to even to even go to a spa trip with my friends. Because society keeps telling me that I'm not, that I'm not really a woman. But then what the hell am I supposed to be? How do, I'm so sorry. I didn't know. I just want to live my life like everyone else, but I'm not even allowed that. How do, sorry. I'm going to hold your hand now. What? I'm a crybaby if you didn't get 
gets that from all the times I've already cried on the internet. Sorry, hun. I'm so stupid. I thought I understood how hard it was, but I didn't. Not even close. Every time I thought I would got what it was like to be transgender, I didn't get it at all. For your birthday, I thought I could help and make things better, but I couldn't. I'm so sorry. Erika, you've already done more than enough. I couldn't even book a spa for your birthday. After you specifically said that you'd like to go to one. No, I mean, when we first met, I was a bit scared of you. Scared? You're really blunt and asked a lot of questions. And you made me feel really uncomfortable, to be honest. But when you met me, you weren't disturbed or disgusted. Even though you're a bit clumsy about it sometimes, you've always tried your best to support me. Sometimes it doesn't work out. That's okay, I'm used to it. But it means so much to me to even have just one more person who just accepts me as, I, as who I am. Haru, Erika, would you look at me, please? What? Thank you for being my friend. How do? Quiet, baby. I kind of want to kiss you now, <laughs> right now. Oh boy! I suspected something like this may occur. What? I I don't know. Sorry, that just slipped out of my mouth. I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, God. <gasps> Somebody please shut me up right now. Do you want snacks? I have snacks. I'm gonna go get snacks. Etika, wait. Did you mean that? I don't know. I think I did. Erika, you know I like, you like Manami, I know. We've had this conversation before. <gasps> no, it didn't. Oh, I didn't get the best end in the other game. So much regret. Hmm, maybe I should go back and play it. Maybe I'll just go back through and, like, get the best end. I probably should do that, huh? Whatever, skip. <laughs> We're going. Moving on. But you still mean what you said? I don't know, okay? I just... I don't really know what I want. What I do know is... I was kind of hurt when I heard about your birthday from Ronomi. And not from you. And when you said that you didn't want Monami to see you like you are now, I kind of didn't like it. And when you smiled at me earlier, I felt really happy. So I just spoke without thinking. Erika, I know you like Monami. You can just like ignore everything I said just now. But you mean all of what you said. Yeah. Thank you so much. Oh, she cried. How did you cry? How did you cry? I'm gonna cry. How did you cry? Oh, man. Getting so attached to cute little cartoon characters. What's wrong with me? What? Why are you crying? I just... I never thought somebody could actually like me that way. I'm so broken in so many ways, so why would anyone ever be attracted to me? Haru, you're not broken. I know, but it feels that way sometimes. So thank you, Erika. You're welcome, I guess. <laughs> but I'm sorry. I like Manami. I know that. You can stop saying it. Like I said, I don't really know what I want, okay? So can we just 
keeping friends like before? Do you want to? Of course I do. Yeah, I don't understand that. Let's take a little side step, side note, tangent. This has nothing to do with the story, but I don't understand in other stories when people are like, in any story from anywhere, people are like, hey, I like you. And the other person is like, I don't like you. And then it's like, they stop talking to each other. What? Like, even if you don't like this person, as more than a friend, doesn't mean you still can't be their friend. And just because this person likes you more than a friend, doesn't mean, like, why would that person just stop talking to you? Like, if you like somebody, even if they don't like you as more than a friend, why would you, how could you just stop talking to them? To me, that feels like your feelings weren't very sincere in the first place. How could you say you like somebody and then just be able to cut them out of your life? You know what I mean? Like, isn't that ridiculous? Or maybe that's just a me thing. Sorry, side tangent. Getting over it. Boo. Okay. Dots. <laughs> then, I'd like that too. Okay, glad that's settled. Oh, right. I still have to give you your birthday present. Be right back. Here. A happy birthday, Haru. What is it? The whole point of wrapping a present is so that you can unwrap it and find out. Is it okay if I unwrap it here? Yeah, go ahead. What is it? I wanna know. This is very taped. I burped. I still feel like I got burped. Deep in my chest. I'm not good at this kind of stuff, okay? No, I didn't mean, I was just making a comment. Just open the present already. Is it a fake ID? So I know it's not actually usable since it's not the real thing, but I thought maybe it's like having an ID card with your actual name and gender on it. Just to have, I guess. I don't know, this is probably really stupid. I love it, Erika. Thank you. It should be pretty durable. I got it printed at a shop. I'll keep it in my wallet. I have a slot for a photo ID in it, but I never wanted to put my ID in there. But this ID card is okay. I'm glad you like it. Etika, I... I'm really happy that we're friends. Me too. So did you want to eat some snacks? You said you like sweet things, right? What did you get? Well, I actually got a huge bag of Nikon. Oh, that's oranges, I think. Since you said you were getting a cold and all. Ah, or maybe they're like tangerines, like small ones. You'll help me finish it, right? Vitamin C is good for colds. Hey, you can't expect me to finish it all by myself. I bought these for you, so take responsibility. But I don't really like Nikon. What? The peel always gets under my fingernails. What do you use? Some little kid? And I'll peel them for you, okay? So you better eat them. Fine. But you have to eat some too. Like I'd let you eat all of them. Fruit aren't cheap, okay? If you're not gonna help me peel, at least pour some herb tea for both of us. Cute! Oh, I like that! April 6th, a day with friends. So cute. Every game by NPCKC is so cute. I don't really know how to say their name. But it's so freaking cute and I love it so much and I just need more games by this person. I hope that forever and ever they always keep re releasing games. I need them. They are my heart and soul. Anyway. <laughs> Thank you everybody for coming out and playing with me. I had a ton of fun. And I'll see you all next time. Um, let me know if you want me to play the first one again so we can get best end. But anyway, <laughs> I'll see you all next time. Bye! <laughs> it makes the devil!